Michigan won the toss to third, so Rutgers will have the ball first. And the Scarlet Knights will start from their own 25-yard line. Remsen will throw it away, complete off the mark, intended for Johnny Langan. Second throw, and that is caught across the 30-yard line by Jaquay Jackson. Remsen throws, that's caught, a slam by Christian Dribble. Dribble's off to the races. He won't be caught. Touchdown, Rutgers. Rutgers, Rutgers touchdown. Wins that complete to Christian Dribble. So we wondered about Wimsett and passing the football well early on, 60 seconds in. Wimsett and the Scarlet Knight offense responds with a big touchdown play to Dremel. So he's working one-on-one -on -one with Sainer still, and Michigan brought the pressure. They expected run. That's what Rutgers likes to do, and they left their best covered corner in Sainer still, their nickel in one-on-one -on -one coverage, but he slipped, and next thing you know, it's good night for Dremel. Great start to the game for Wimsett. Extra point is good for Jay Patel. So the Scarlet Knights and Gavin Wimsett waste little time. 69-yard pass play and the fourth touchdown thrown by Wimsett this season at Greg Schiano. And the Scarlet Knights lead 7-0. There is a flag. Illegal substitution. 12 on the field on the defense. Penalty is declined. The try is good. Short kick. Now we saw Bowling Green do this last week here. AJ Carter. Tight end across the 35 yard line. So good field position for the Wolverines and now the offense. Blake Corn, his first carry. And out to the 42 yard line, a gain of five. Warm coming off a 100-yard rushing game last week against Bowling Green. Carthy time, and it's tipped and incomplete. Intended for Loveland. And broken up by Deion Jennings, third down. Deion Jennings going out in coverage to match him. Looks very bottom under the screen at 35. For Carthy, pressure from behind. He's dropped back at the 40-yard line. Good coverage downfield then. Tyreen Powell got home. It's fourth down, a loss of two. Going to spike, good field position, three and out for Michigan. Tommy Dolman to the shot Rochelle. And a fair catch at the 21. First time all year the Wolverines are trailing in a game. Menunga opens up down the sideline. Cuts back across the 45. And the reigning Big Ten Offensive Player of the Week runs for 27 and a Scarlet Knight first down. This is what Menunga does so well. Is This is it Holding. starts as an inside zone. Offense number oh. 72. 10-yard penalty. Repeat first down. Well, he still does it well, but sometimes <laughs> you see a, your offensive line holds. All the way back to the 11. Right side this time. Out to the 17. After a game of six, that would find the Curry Page along with Michael Perry. Manunga cuts back across the 25. This is going to make it third and manageable now. Four Rutgers on back to back run plays to Manunga. Picked up 10 more there. It's 34. Once again, watch out for Wimsett pulling it on a quarterback read here. Now some movement early. And this will cost Rutgers five more. False start. Offense number 72. Five-yard penalty. That makes third down. 
on that third down and nine. Menunga in the backfield is dropped for a loss. So some penalties hurt Rutgers on that drive. And on third and nine, Derek Moore made the stop. And it's fourth down. Jake Paul waiting at the Michigan 36. Great punt. And now it takes a Rutgers friendly foul. Still going. That's bouncing out of bounds inside the 10. And they'll mark it out at the six yard line. There, try that left side. A gain of maybe two. Hurdles oh. across the 15. First down. Oh. Near the 23. Warm runs for 100 yards in the game. Michigan is 13 and 0 all time. Picked up 14 there. Moore picked up a block, and that's incomplete. Looking for Roman Wilson. Hardly had time because Corp picked up a big block at second down. That time, and Roman Wilson with the great route had a lot of separation, five, six yards. Quick screen this time. Savage Morgan. To the 29. What do you do when your quarterback's struggling? It's like in basketball, you go get a layup. Edwards had a big game against Rutgers in the Scandaway last year. And now he's wide open. Donovan Edwards across midfield. Knocked down inside the 40. You start with the screen to settle J.J. in and then give him a wide open pass to his big target. Yard line again of four for Johnny Langan. Vincent slides down. Again across the 30 to the 31, sitting a third down. Vincent keeps it. Vincent will stretch and have the first down. Needed four, picked up five, but the Scarlet Knights moved the chains. Wilson kicked it. Good decision. First down across midfield. Gavin Wilson kept the ball. Down by Mikey Saber still after a gain of one. That's caught open. 
Kikwe Jackson will have a first down. To the 34. As the pile builds at the 30, it'll be third down and short upcoming for Rutgers. Rutgers going on third down today. The job that's taken over five minutes. Manungai hit. And he'll be short of the first down. So as the clock winds down, decision time. Fourth down and short upcoming for the Scarlet Knights. Ford Rutgers on fourth down, a perfect three of three. Michigan defensively yet to allow a fourth down conversion. Slow developing and buried. There is a flag down near the line of scrimmage before the ball was snapped false start offense instead of going for it now it's going to be a 51 yard try for jay patel he's made from 51 against temple Eight of five and third down, and there is Sharon Moore. So that opened up for McCarthy and a first down. And Edwards this time, well contained by the Rutgers front. Gain a close to two for Edwards. Edwards spinning his way across the 25. So McCarthy hung in there, took a big hit, and now decision time here for Jim Harbaugh. That's Cameron Stewart, or excuse me, that's Aaron Lewis coming through. You got to have your eyes on 71. He's the best defensive lineman for Rutgers, and completely untouched, clean path for a clean hit on JJ. And whistles will blow that kick dead. Before the ball was snapped, delay a game, offense, five-yard penalty, remains fourth down. So a mistake there for Michigan. This now a 42-yard drop. It's low, and that one leaking left, and it is no good. No game. 
Get a grant. Jackson at the pitch. And he's shouldered out. See what a spot of just about a yard and a half shy of the first down. It'll be third down. in the conference they've met the challenge here to start the game now forcing Michigan into a third and eight Roman Wilson top of your screen is not in a catch yet Sit on seven straight completions. Good run. space. Out of bounds across the 35 yard line. Wide open. Back side of the field, and McCarthy races for 22. Intended for Cornelius Johnson. Before the ball was snapped, timeout, Michigan, their second of the half. Up four, third down. Upcoming for Michigan. McCarthy has four men at his side. Looking right, throws that way, stretching and catching is Lublin. And he'll be near the first down. And he's going to be marked short by about a yard. It's fourth down. And one. All this wide branch and, and Colston motions down to a stack formation so he's able to get one-on-one -on -one coverage with Max Melton, who's one of the best cover corners in Rutgers secondary. Colston won, and the crowd isn't liking it because Loveland reached out, and I think that they believe there's a case to be made that he got it. And now play will be halted. The ruling on the previous play is the runner was short of the line of game. The play's under further review. The ruling on the field stands. Fourth foul. Now, well, Steve, thank you. And Jim Harbaugh asking for further clarification. Have not converted on fourth down this season. The 21, first down, Michigan. Five minutes on this drive. What? Move of that body. His legs out to the 18 yard line. I feel good at, at any point in this game. Off one action, the car in trouble, avoids it, looking for less than incomplete. Coverage from Max Melton. 
that's the same route so it's man to man coverage Roman Wilson's working on a crosser Max Melton in coverage Defense number 16. Kelly the fly. Touchdown. So the first collegiate touchdown reception for the freshman from West Bloomfield, Michigan, Samaj Morgan. Turner. Extra point is good. Michigan pinned back as they start the third quarter. Michigan a pretty clean first half. One penalty, no turnovers, and only one negative play. That's it complete off the mark at the 15-yard line intended for Johnson. there balls out there towards the bottom it's a new point now toss to call slam down a yard and a shot at the line of the game another third and short upcoming Corb comes out on third and one it's Edwards and this will depend on the spot And he's short. It's fourth down. On fourth and short, McCarthy kept it. Out of bounds near the 45. JJ McCarthy. Just like we saw in the first half, you get into these short yarded situations. Everyone in the stadium is expecting to run up the gut. That's been their M.O., but just like in the first half, J.J. McCarthy reads it out, pulls it, and moves the chains. Illegal formation, five men in the backfield, offense, five-yard penalty, repeat first down. There's Aaron Lewis in pursuit, who's found himself in the backfield a number of times already in this game, but it didn't matter because five men in the backfield. Ripped out of the ankles. 
Great tackle by Mohamed Toure. Nice play of the drive. Time for McCarthy. Wilson wide open. First down to the 35. Reception for Wilson today. Now one catch in 22 straight games. It's caught. He'll have a first down. A gain of 11. Not much there for Corm. Seven minutes, 12 play of the drive. Corm nearly 40 yards rushing on this drive alone. McCarthy throws, look at the fire, that's incomplete. Tyreen Paul with him step for step. Look that short motion. McCarthy goes down. Back to the 29-yard line. Wesley Bailey with the sack. Now five and a half career sacks, his first this season, and Rutgers makes a big play on third down. Wesley Bailey working up top against Miles Hinton, the right tackle. This is just one-on-one. -on -one. Can you protect J.J. McCarthy's front side? And no, you can't. Wesley Bailey wasn't even a, a, a great explosive move, but he just kind of opens the door and slowly opens the hips of Miles Hinton until he's in the lap of J.J. Brings him down. Turner drills this one. Missed from 42, made that one from 46, and the Wolverines, a time-consuming drive. Yard strike to Dremel. One minute into the game, not much for Rutgers in terms of the passing game. Wonder. False start. Offense number 57. Five yard penalty. Remains second down. Guys, we saw Flip Dixon come out of the game on that last Rutgers defensive drive. What we first thought was maybe a cramp, but once we took a second look, it appeared that he got rolled on. He's in the tent on the sidelines. I'll let you guys know once I find out more. All right, Brooke, thanks. Transfer from Minnesota. Safety, Flip Dixon. And that had no chance at a flag. Josh Wallace, he got tangled up with Isaiah Washington. Josh Wallace and they're just running a hitch outside now he was early and that the crowd doesn't like it but he was certainly early pass interference defense number 12 the ball will be placed at the spot of the foul automatic first down Michigan fans doing what Michigan fans have to do right of course you can never agree with the call but we just saw it there he's certainly early First defensive penalty on Michigan today. Catching a gain of 17. Man, that is a heck. Look at the fingertips. Oh, ball's moving there at the end. The second with the second. 
let's see. It's a great shot. <laughs> it's a great shot nonetheless. Timeout, Michigan, their first of the half. What happened, never even looked at it, so a 17 yard play, Steve, we thank you. Samuel Brown down to tailback. Winston throws and coming back to the 45. Incomplete. Once on this drive. Winston will throw again. The 34. That's a catch. Into wow. the Michigan sideline. Washington. A long round, perfectly thrown, and that's a great call. Clean catch, put down. We came right back to him <laughs> on the sideline. Washington's got his toe down out of bounds. Wimson, some he likes about that right sideline. That's throwing it. In. He's got this big, talented arm, Just so much arm strength. He can make all the throws on the field. It's three times now in this drive where he's throwing it out all the way out to the sideline with accuracy. Great throws on this drive for Wimson. Into the air, and that's incomplete. Here, the 25. Michigan bringing pressure high. Incomplete. Here, the 25. Washington and a flag. And this is going to be on Will Johnson. Maybe a little taunting there on the high throw to Washington. It was just a, a push. Okay. Right there. There is no foul for unsportsmanlike on the play. Third down. This is football. There's nothing egregious. Sometimes Washington will get it, he'll give it to him. Treble, he'll be short of the line to gain. A gain of eight, but a nice catch by a former walk-on. Michigan's defense hasn't allowed a fourth down conversion all year. Screen. Denied. And that ball's in the hands of Sandler still. Matthew Sandler still. Taking it all the way. Touchdown, Michigan. still all over the field he does it bringing the pressure he does it with the guy hanging on his back junior calls and he says get off me junior i got a date with the end zone and that is evidence that saber still never went down just think about the fork in the road of that fourth down a huge play for both teams i don't like the play call throwing a screen <laughs> His way back from a foot injury that cost him a large chunk of 2022. He is back on the field. That screen over the middle, incomplete. Lieutenant for Sean Bowman, the backup tight end, is third down. And then Jim Harbaugh always believed to play court, to play safety, to play defense. Move permanently to the defensive backfield in the spring of last season. Just keep our eyes on Wimson here and uh, uh, 
a, a situation where you're coming off an interception, it's third down, can you stay disciplined? Before the ball was snapped, timeout, Rutgers, their first of the half. A final third and seven for Winston and the Scarlet Knights. Just two of seven on third down today. Multiple flags. Right side of that offensive ball line is moving. Offense number 63. Five-yard penalty. And they third down. Third and long. Wimsett throws, that's caught, but well shy of the line to gain by Dremble. And once again, he's there. Like the same as Dutch. Good punt, but no return for Jake Thaw. This one down near the 34-yard line. Welcome back. Cliff Dixon was taken out of the game just earlier in the second half, and we thought it was a cramp, but then we looked at it and looked like he was rolled on. He was in the tent. Now he is out. He's been walking around, running along the sidelines, and he is out on the field right now, but he does have tape around that lower right leg. Something to keep an eye on, guys. Right, thanks. Transferred from Minnesota. Recruited by defense coordinator Joe Harrisimiak at Minnesota. And now Dixon right on cue makes that stop after a game of about four. So for about one. That one was zone, right? You see no polars, everybody's stepping in unison, the whole line's working as one, there's no cross pattern, so that's inside zone, and it's just been tough to get anything going here. McCarthy on third down, and working his way and stretching that football for a first down, had to reach the 44, and it looked like he got near the 45. And based on that spot, it is a first down for Michigan. That extra stretch there for McCarthy moves the chains. Well, they tell you, be careful reaching the football, right? Ball security is key. <laughs> he reached it and then tucked it back right away. Final 45 seconds. The first quarter dominated by Michigan. Another zone play. Game for Edwards. Mr. Brightside turns into a great play. McCarthy to Wilson. That song is about 20 years old. And an anthem here. Yard plays. Before many of these students read a board. Oh, hello. hello. <laughs> pulling it down. Special teams coordinator Jay Harbaugh. He said, you know what? I'm going to show you tape of this tight end in Idaho. He's my kind of guy. Look at him stem right there. So he knows he wants to get to the scene, but it's not just about running straight. He's going to route and show a little outside on Loyal number six. And then JJ, knowing he's got a big tight end, just puts it up top. Another one to his uh, to his arsenal. Nine catches all year, four alone today. Turner. 
31 straight for Michigan. Catch for Sean Rochelle and Rick Shiano. Maybe one. to the 36, gate of nine. <laughs> to Ian Straw, his first catch today, third all season, picks up 18 more. <laughs> Just run out to the 40-yard line by Samuel Brown. The guy that was having a huge game against Indiana last season in Piscataway before he hurt his foot and missed the final five games of 2022. A strong, talented back. He's from Philadelphia. His last season, promising before he got hurt. He's working his way back. He's going to be an important piece of this Rutgers ground game as they get into the meet of the conference season. That's it. Cut back, and he'll be spotted down a yard shy of the first down by Junior Colson. Here is Aaron Young, number four, to win six left. He hasn't played yet this season. And now his first carry. First down run for Aaron Young. Keeps his feet. To the 23. Gain of 14 for Aaron Young. So to play the drive. Young. To the 26. Brooke, what do you have? Yeah, guys, and people have talked about Kyle Manungai as being Mr. Fourth Quarter, just how explosive he is and how he reads those defenses and how fatigued they are towards the end of the game. So it is interesting that they haven't seen, that he hasn't seen much action towards here uh, in the end of the game. All right, Brooke, thanks. Ball to 21, red line. the 20 yard line. Yeah. The Rams bring the world. Rips it. And the coverage got knocked away. Quentin Johnson had a pick last week. Knocked that away from Dremel and it's fourth down. And Rutgers, the offense, is going to stay on the field. Fourth and six. Rips it. Complete. Intended for Dremel. And Michigan will take over. Blake Horn, captain. Fine way to begin his season, adding to that today with a couple of touchdown runs. He is the tailback behind. J.J. McCarthy. Rolling, rolling, caught. Loveland. The captain. To me, he looks healthy. He, he, he's bouncing and cutting and making split decisions on both knees. Running back across the 25, it'll be third down. Just for the football nerds out there, that was power. Thirty. Now 
often notice in the background the Let's Go Irish chant. He's closing in on another 100 yard game. Got seven more there, now three shy of 100. Linebacker running back now in the spring full time. His defense before today, a group that was allowing only 70 yards rushing per game in the ground. And they've given up now more than a buck 80 today. There's Mullings again, under three to play. Mullings is smacked. You're the musical guy, right? Try in spare time. Sorry. Hello, buddy. Would be tackling that pile kept on moving all the way to the 31 yard line. Nine more for money. Still a challenge for Michigan, as you mentioned, the upcoming schedule. They, they've yet to play, in my opinion, a full 60 minute clean game. They've played excellent at times. There's been some times where they've made mistakes. But if they want to reach their ultimate goal, it's going to take everybody for 60 minutes. $100,000 plus once again, this beautiful first day of fall. Rutgers raced out to a 7 0 lead. Since then, 31 straight by the Wolverines. Final play of the game. Michigan more than 400 yards of total offense today. And Jim Harbaugh in his first game back on the sideline is a winner. Michigan stays unbeaten 31-7 over Rutgers today.